Hey everyone, I am on a lovely date night with my husband. I just had an epiphany. We're sitting here watching the waves and he's agreed that I can quickly make a video and share it with you. So behind me, there are a whole lot of surfers that have climbed across the tracks, they've paddled out there, they're waiting for that perfect wave and about 10 minutes ago, the one guy got the dream wave. He rode it all the way in. I just watched him living his best life. It was incredible. He was carving up that wave like nobody's business. And then I could see the wave was going to run out, but he was doing brilliantly. Like the wave wasn't going to win. He was winning. And I realized he was going to have to choose to end that incredible moment of exhilaration. He was going to have to submit to the water to just fall into it and then paddle out and join everyone and wait again to see if another opportunity was going to strike. And it made me realize that's life. Life is this waiting game, waiting for those opportunities that if we're experienced, if we've put in the time, if we've put in the energy and the effort, we can ride it and see how far it's going to take us. But at some point, often those highs need to come to, you know, a necessary end and we have to go back and start again. But obviously we're taking all that experience with us and we can ride whatever else life gives us. And so it just was such a beautiful moment going, sometimes you have to choose to go, this has been amazing. I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna look for some more. And so I'm really taking that with me because it's a year since I won the World Championship of Public Speaking. Four weeks ago, Cyril Jr. Dim took over that ride for me and it was incredible to see him step onto the platform as the new champion and go, this is my turn to paddle back out and see what's next. So whatever waves you're riding, what's important is, are you enjoying the ride? Are you feeling that joy that we feel when we're moving towards our potential? And are you open to sometimes it's okay to go back to the back line and wait for that next opportunity? With that thought in mind, I'm going to go back to my date because that's going really well.